Hey Phil, KP68 here. I want to do a really quick video of your new amplifier. I finished building this yesterday, got it tuned up this morning. Uh, I know you're borrowing Mr. Frequency's amplifier I built for him about a year ago. You liked it so much. Here's one of your own. Uh, this is a Lou Ross design as far as component values go. So I don't want to take credit and never want to take credit for somebody else's uh, work. So it's not going too crazy or anything. I'm going to show you what's going into the amplifier right now. The amplifier is off. It's just the radio. This is channel 38, lower sideband, into a dummy load. Audio 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. All right, I'm going to switch the amplifier on. There's the switch. This is Class C. Up and down is Class AB. I know you like to said you like to shout, talk on channel 20 AM uh, with some of the guys. So there's an option for you. So here we go. Audio 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Audio 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I don't like the yell, scream, whistle into the microphone. I just like to do my testing just like how I talk on air. Here's the oscilloscope. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Audio 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Audio. All right. Just like I said, I'm not going to get too crazy technical or anything. I'm going to switch over to uh, AM. Uh, except for SWR. There's key up. One key. Key up. Uh, I'm going to switch to channel 1. Back up to channel 40. Go to channel 20. So, this sucker should last you a really long time. Uh, this is not your typical Class E Screamer amplifier, but what you have here is an extremely stable, clean amplifier for sideband. I'll talk to you later, Phil. KP68, cleared.